April 15th, 2022. We're here at the Arapaho Basin Ski Area, one of my favorite places on earth. And it looks like we have a little bit of a sleeper powder day situation. Let's take you on through it. into the spine, as they call it. Blows in somewhere in here, yep. Oh yeah. Spine line.
that's where I wanted to go. like a really cool pillow zone <laughs> like some real deal stuff in here uh, 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 the side of this pillow right here. It just went like this. Uh, and, uh, whoa. What a cool little area in here. <laughs> Here we go. We're at the Steve Kelly's now. Not quite sure where to go. I don't really know my way around the gully yet. Oh. Supposed to need some pow in though. Oh. 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 Whoa. Okay. I can either drop in right here or go that way. I think I'm going to go this way this way uh, gotta tread light there could be sharks uh. yep No idea what number this is but uh these are definitely gnarlier i don't know if those are open but uh we're in it now this lower powder zone looks good oh.
Them gullies are steep. Oh, what a sleeper day. Take us below the base area into a nice long hike. It's worth it. <laughs> what a lot! So yeah, we got to hike out of here. This terrain ends up below the uh, base area. So we got to hike back up to that poly chair. This is where we dropped in last time. I believe this is two. Patrol recommended me to go try six. I think it's through here somewhere. Uh, yeah, there's more gullies as we come down the ridge line here. Yep. I guess we just passed three. This is four through eight. So this must be four. pretty good in there but I think we might continue <laughs> that's closed but I think this is it But this might be five. Uh, I think it's the next one. I believe we're at Steep Gully 6 here. And this is what the patrol recommended to me. Oh. This is catchy in here. The show. Huh. Okay. Maybe go in there. Don't see many tracks. Don't really want to get cliffed out. This is what we'll hit it's right here. Some thick stuff in here. Nice. That must be four, five maybe.
that sun is starting to poke through. Ho oh. ho. Stuff back here is nuts. First hike wasn't so bad. Now this now this second hike is starting to wear on me. Sun's poking through. I think it might be time to go check out their upper bowls terrain out in the beavers zuma east wall perhaps let's take you through it it's a good hike out of here we made it back to the chair might not do any more hiking today it's about a 25 to a 30 minute hike out to drop into beavers so. <laughs> it's all in track in here oh crunchy underneath a little nonetheless <sighs> a little thin under here. Made it back to the beaver's lift. Really good tree skiing back here. It really is a big mountain. You can drop behind this rope and hike out to this lift too. It's where we were earlier, steep gullies. We're up here on Founders Ridge. Each of these runs down into the bowl is named after one of the founders. There was like seven of them. Uh -huh. To go out to elephant trunk but i don't think it's open today 
this area will have to do. <laughs> Definitely some sharks. <laughs> No snow on that. <laughs> Sometimes you can't tell if you can pop off these or not. Bull today. All on track.
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Jeez. Ah! <laughs> 
we're just hopping over here. We closed the pally chair down. We're just coming over here because it's the end of the day. We're a little tired. We don't want to walk up the hill. But we're going to try to start making our way back to the car. We can see if we can ski all the way there today. They got a really cool mid-mountain lodge here. They allow foot traffic to come up. And they got a snowshoe trail. So overall, this is just a beautiful place to come.